So when I did public art when I was a lot younger, I could be much more aggressive and um, satirical. You know, really what an artist uh, normally gets to do, an artist gets to self-initiate their own work that comes out of their own uh, uh, soul. You know, it's that beautiful late afternoon light. Um, that he was basking in, you know, in that, uh, in that warmth. Well, this is tiny, right, because all the other mosaics are, uh, you know, the one I did for um, the Atlanta Federal Center, we'll say, that was uh, 30 feet tall and 130 feet long. It turned out to be four by seven and a half feet, so there were like 16 sections. Yeah. So uh, I, I did have some of my students come from uh, Tufts. They did, they did half of it in one day, and then Chantal and I did the other half over the course of the next week. Uh, a yard sign, and it's, you know, you can just put it in and you can take it away. And it, but here I'm using, you know, architectural materials in a, in a format that's really a permanent installation. What I can do is to use my my creativity to be able to make a strong statement visually. It would be nice if uh, there was a place for it, you know, either at um, somebody, some uh, place, some governmental building. The fact that uh, people are driving by and they get to see something that I designed that is a celebration of Obama. That so I mean, I could have chosen to uh, to make a more uh, politically um, uh, you know, satirical comment. I think what I chose instead to do was to uh, uh, make Obama just look much more um, uh, tender and uh, and full of uh, American tradition.